हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल टुडे वी गोइंग टू रीमेक आर स्क्वायर कैलकुलेटर प्रोजेक्ट व्हिच वी क्रिएटेड इन आप लैब कोड डॉट ओआरजी इन टू टेक्सचुअल जावास्क्रिप्ट वी गोइंग टू क्रिएट इट इन टेक्सचुअल जावास्क्रिप्ट इफ यू हैव नॉट सीन दैट वीडियो प्लीज सी इट द लिंक इज इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन सो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू अ वेरी वेरी क्विक प्रीव्यू ओवर हियर व्हाट इज द लेंथ ऑफ योर लैंड इन किलोमीटर्स so if my uh, the length of my land is 2 then the area of my land is 4 uh, kilometer per uh, kilometer square so there was no option of writing 2 a uh, little smaller and upwards so i have to I write it like this the perimeter of your land is 8 kilometer because 4 in, uh, 2 into 4 is equals to 8 you can also check the console for meters into kilometers converter this is for those people who have the length of their land in meters and obviously you need to enter that in kilometer so go in the console option and in the console app option you have this this link just click on this link and then it's a converter how many meters do ha- i want to convert into kilometers if i want to convert Three thousand, four thousand kilometers. It would be four kilometer. So this is all of it, guys. Let's get rocking in it. So guys, uh, in our MSVS folder, I just created a MSVS code folder. I just created a new folder, remake of all projects, because we are just going to remake every other else project, like the age applica, age application. This not the country info. But yeah, we're going to create the age application also. So let's go rocking in it. Now, uh, in the remake of all projects, we're going to add new project, JavaScript project, which is going to be the yes. Let I'm just gonna think of a cool name for it. It should yes, square. calculator dot js okay and in this square calculator dot js I'm going to put it inside the remake of all projects folder now we're going to add a new project of HTML is going to be home be home base dot HTML And then this home base h dot html is going to be inside this remake of all project. Now, home base in home base dot html we're going to add the code using the word doc. And now I just figured this out. Uh, if you write anything else over here except document, then like over here it's written document. It would be changed to the name that you give it to. Give it. So. So, uh, we're going to name it screen time calculate calculate uh calculator okay uh so in this title tag we're writing screen time calculator okay this is the head this is the body and inside body we always write i i told you that inside body always write we never write in between head and body it would be wrong then the script source would be now we're going to add script source and that source would be square calculator.js okay now we're going to start coding the uh, calculator so now we're going to create a variable we're going to declare a variable and assign a value to it so the variable name would be length and the variable length is equals to the prompt function that we are going to add which would ask the user what is the l- length of your land please tell this in kilo meters okay we're going to write it like that now we're going to see how our uh prompt function is looking so we're going to open we're going to open 
the msvs code folder and inside the rem uh, and go to the remake of all projects folder and then just click on the home base html which we created so what is the length of your land and for your information you can give any name to your project it could be any xyz name that you want to give okay what is the length of your land please tell this in kilometers okay this is looking fine and as you can see it's coming screen time calculator instead of document as i told you all didn't i okay let's jump into this a lot more so we're going to add a new alert function before that we're going to declare a variable yes variable area is equal to sorry yeah variable area is equal to uh, area is calculated by the number into the number length into length okay length into length the variable area is going to be the length into length and the variable perimeter perimeter is going to be 4 multiplied by length the variable okay now whenever you will write text in it it would be uh, nan so we are going to also give a warning to them Rem, uh, uh, do not write text remember do not write text and an exclamation mark okay cool i'm going to make this a little smaller so that you can see it yes variable parameter is equals to uh, 4 into the length so now we're taking this as an example that variable length is one so that it will be easier for you to understand everything so if variable area variable area is equals to length into length that means one into one which is equals to one and variable parameter which we declared is equals to four into length four into length is equal four into length length is one so four into length is equals to four so that means your area is equals to one uh, kilometer cube kilometer square sorry and the perimeter is uh, going to be four okay now we're going to add two alert functions sorry i'm writing everything in capital alert the area of your of your land is equal to what is the uh, the area of your land is equal to and then it's the area so now we have to write km2 over there so space plus area we did this in the previous video also the area of your land is equals to a uh, space plus area plus km2 so it's going to be the so area is equals to one as i told you all the area of a land is equals to area that means one so one kilometer square and then one more alert function which is going to be now i'm just going to copy it because we just need to make slight changes in uh, the next alert not a lot changes or very slight changes so the area of your land instead of area it should be perimeter of your land is equals to the variable perimeter and instead of km2 it should be just km that means kilometer okay and now in the console we're going to add one more thing but that we're going to do a little later now over here we just have to write last alert function you can check the console for a link for a meter into kilometer just 
sorry just in case no just uh, leave it like that you can check the console for a link for a meter into kilometer converter okay and you can write your own messages also there is no force to write the exact text that i am writing in over here it would not make it wrong you just need to uh, take care of the brackets that you are putting and you are putting this in case you are creating it a string okay and all of these you have to just take take a little care if you are changing the messages okay now we are going to create the kilometer sorry the meter into kilometer converter so now a new file meter into km dot js okay meter into kilometer dot js okay now let's go into this and uh, it's going to ask a prompt so variable we are going to store the prompt in a variable so variable answer is equals to prompt that prompt would ask you can give a space between this prompt or not give that would not make everything wrong it would be just fine like over here in the square calculator i gave a space but over here i'm not giving don't get confused don't get confused okay so the variable answer is equals to prompt how many meters sorry, meters do you want to convert into uh, the how many meters do you want to convert into kilometers kilometers and then a question mark then the alert and then we are going to create one more uh, variable variable final answer final answer you can uh, name the variable anything again just don't get uh, like stuck somewhere that i just need to name the variable the thing uh, the exact name that i am giving the variable okay now after that uh, we're going to put a equal to sign and the variable final answer is equals to 10000 divided by uh, the oh yeah 10,000 divided by our variable answer. Okay. Now we're going to just check if that, if this equation is correct or not. Yes. So alert final answer. Yes, alert final answer. So this alert is not required right now. I was just checking something. Variable final answer is equal to this. Okay. Now there is going to be an alert. Your value is equal to, and then a final answer, and then a plus sign, and then final answer, and then. Oh, really sorry. Yes. But then this, you know, uh, into into in inverted common, this over here, and then add this, and then add uh, with space kilometer. I understand this so like this over here. And I just forgot to add a plus sign over here. Yes. Now we're going to save this. And uh, let's see, we're going to now just create a HTML file from where the meter into kilometer converter would work. So meter into kilometer converter dot HTML. Okay. And then HTML we're going to add document the abbreviation 
and then and then this code should come we are going to give it the title title let's think of a name meter into kilo meter converter okay and then the body the source the script source is going to be meter dot js meter into kilometer dot js i bet now we're going to save this and let's go into it what is the length of a lamp please tell this in kilometer remember to not write text if my uh, the length of my land is 2 then the area is 4 kilometer uh, square and the perimeter is 8 kilometer because 2 into 4 is equal to 8 you can check the console for a link for a meter into kilometer converter let's see if our meter into kilometer converter is fine Working. okay yes now the problem was that over here in the square calculator we did not add the console dot log we did not add the link for the same for the converter we can then a string you are declaring a string and then we're going to open our uh, html file and then the we're going to copy this link the full link control c and then in the console just do control v and let's save this and redo it all two four kilometer uh, square and perimeter of your land is eight kilometer you can check the console let's go to inspect and see okay it's in the elements also and it's in the console option also so in the elements by chance you're getting the console over oh, here now if you'll click this how many meters do you want to convert into kilometers? We want to convert 1000 meters into kilometer. Your value is equal to 1 kilometer. Okay guys, this is it. Thank you for watching. And see you guys next time. Till then, bye bye. We're going to just like add one more. All the app, all the apps that we created on App Lab in this series. In This is not a series. Like we, This is included into textual JavaScript series. But this is like a bonus video series you can see inside textual java so you can say that it is a bonus sub series yeah this you can say bonus sub series and then we're going to see you in the next video of this bonus sub series we're not going to create the country info app because we're not covering on how to add buttons over here or else how will the country info work we were switching screens we can't do that uh, or maybe I'll think of something. If I would, I will just inform you in the next video. If I don't, I will inform you that also in the next video. Meet you over there. Till then, bye. -bye. Thank you.